Richard for is Tech. As always, we bring you tech reviews, tips and tutorials to help you live life smarter. And today I have the Dell U27-19DC monitor. In the box, you get the stand base, the stand riser monitor, power cable, the USB type C, DP cable, factory calibration report, and a quick setup guide. Mounting is simple. Clamp the vertical mount to the base, screw it in with the captive thumb screw, off you go. Since it is a U-series monitor, so it sports the Visa mount with a dimension of 100 by 100, you can always get two of these for seamless viewing, but I would recommend two 24-inch models to go side by side. Looks-wise, it has a lot to impress as Dell carries its black and grey look and feel. It's premium all the way with a build quality that's more durable and light. The panel is pretty thin and the base is small as well, so you can have more room on your desk. You can bypass cables through the hole to keep them out of sight. Height is easily adjustable for up to 130 millimeters. Then you can have it tilted for all that works smooth. You can even swivel it from minus 40 to 40 degrees. Pivot it 90 degrees both clockwise or anti-clockwise if you're willing to see your stocks or spreadsheets vertically. A bit about the display. It's an anti-glare 27 inch screen that comes with 2560 by 1440 resolution. Images bright with 350 nits of brightness and a contrast ratio of 1000 to 1. Images are sharp and text is very clear. Overall production of the display is very natural and very lifelike. If you're looking for more bright displays then you should be looking at the S series of Dell's monitors. But I find this bright enough. This comes with a refresh rate of 60Hz, so if you plan to game at higher frame rates, then this might not be your favorite pick. You get to have more viewing area as Dell pushes the viewing area further and making these bezels even thinner. Watching most multimedia content on this is definitely enjoyable with its sharp colors. Now it is an ideal pick for content creators and professionals because every single unit comes factory calibrated to give you the best color reproduction straight out of the box. What that means is you get 99% of sRGB and 85% of DCI-P3 color gamut, which can be of interest to those who are into video production and graphic design. It is a TUV certified, so you get a flicker-free screen and reduced blue light emissions. It's a 33 watt power consuming monitor, which gives you convenient connectivity. With the USB-C, you get power, you got video and you got data going through a single USB-C cable. However, make sure that the laptop sports USB Type-C power delivery and has a maximum charging power of 65 watts, or else the monitor will require the supplied power cable to power it up. Dell is offering a premium panel exchange. In case you see any fault or disappearing pixels in your panel within the three-year warranty period, you will get a replacement ship the very next business day. So a little peace of mind. So if you're looking for a display to maximize your productivity, get maximum viewing area, good connectivity options, and a very decent brightness, and on top of that, you get good calibrated colors, then this might be the best choice that you should be looking at. At the moment of reviewing, it's coming for around $450, which is pretty convincing price considering the form factor, durability, and the performance as per my experience. So I'm gonna be posting the links in the description if you wish to order one for yourself. It would have been my dream monitor if only it was 144 hertz instead of the 60 hertz. Well, I just like gaming. Links to this will be given in the description below. Don't forget to put down your comments. Let us know if you'll be buying this monitor. If not, which monitor will you be getting? And if you enjoyed the review, don't forget to hit that subscribe and like that video because we'll be seeing you very soon with another review. Till again, Forest Tech signing out.